you need to remember that when you're checking out on her site, you're checking out in pounds. And when that converts to US dollars, baby, it's a very different number, okay? Hey babes, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Shaylin, and in today's video, I am bringing you babes a black owned clothing haul slash accessory haul slash anything black owned that I've picked up. I'm a black woman and I love supporting black owned businesses, especially black owned female businesses. I love uplifting, supporting, shouting out businesses that look like me. That could be me. That could be my sister. That could be my mom. So I 100% recommend supporting black owned businesses and we are going to continue to support them on this channel because a business cannot thrive, succeed without support. And I'm here to show my black brothers and sisters all the support and love that they need. Okay, before we go ahead and jump into this video, please be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Also be sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and hit that notification bell so you don't miss an upload. But without further ado, let's get straight into the video okay babe so let's go ahead and jump into the first category of items that i want to share with you babes and that is jewelry y'all know your girl loves her some jewelry and i love me some black owned jewelry brands one of my top top black owned jewelry brands that i love to support is stella and haas nine times out of ten if i'm wearing a piece of jewelry and you want to know where i got it from go to the stella and haas website because that is where i get most of my gems from the necklace that i'm currently wearing is actually my angel numbers i hope i don't have it on backwards but if i do girl i'm sure you know what the number 444 looks like okay so these are basically my angel numbers and i have been wearing this necklace non-stop since i've got it i've worn this necklace in the pool i've worn this necklace in the beach i've worn this necklace in the shower to work out and girl it still looks exactly the same as when i picked it up that is one thing that i love about stella and haas not only are their items really affordable but you also are getting very high quality items items that you don't have to worry about tarnishing items you don't have to worry about replacing and i just think that is amazing they have amazing customer service girl and they have fast shipping okay and they always doing discounts and deals i do have a discount code for them it is shaylin 10 i believe so i will put that on screen also in the description box down below if you guys want to use that i also picked up a another necklace from them recently and this is a pretty much like an astrology pendant so if you guys don't know your girl is a taurus okay so this is pretty much like an astrology type of pendant so i do usually layer this with my number four necklace or i actually like wearing this on its own because it's like very 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 dainty which which I like. I love wearing this for more dressier events on its own. Love, love, love Stella and Haas. They are definitely one of my top jewelry brands, black owned or not. The next items that I want to get into are from Oma the Label, which again is another favorite of mine when it comes to jewelry. I will say this, that their jewelry is a bit more pricey and it is not advertised as water resistant tarnish resistant or anything like that so just keep that in mind if you're thinking about picking up any jewelry items from them but i picked up these gorgeous hoops and i've had these for quite some time now i love that these hoops are super different i've never seen any hoops like this um and i picked these up specifically to wear with a specific outfit also i don't have much silver jewelry so i definitely wanted to elevate my silver jewelry collection girl these hoops are so cute they are the perfect weight they're not too heavy but they're also not too light to the point where they feel really really cheap and I just think they are the perfect size as well they're just so cute like look y'all these are so freaking cute I love me a good hoop and I just thought these were really different and I haven't seen any hoops like that so love these hoops again really really nice quality but are not tarnish or water resistant I have not tested out wearing these in the pool the water girl anywhere like that okay baby because I am going to follow directions okay if they tell me take off before showering take off before swimming baby i'm gonna do so okay because these hoops was not cheap but i do not regret buying them because they are very very different and they are really really high quality as well the next item that i want to share with you babes is actually a gift that i received from my boyfriend for my birthday and i have yet to wear this bag but i had wanted a brandon blackwood bag for the longest and i finally got one shout out to my man okay Curious, but anyways i wanted his bucket bag because i just don't see a lot of people with this bag and i just think it's so cute and it's so different so he got me this one it is so 
cute you guys like it is this beautiful baby blue kind of like periwinkle color it's like blue but it almost has like a purplish undertone to me so it says Brandon Blackwood on the tag here then you have this handle and it also comes with a crossbody strap so if you want to wear it crossbody me personally I probably would not wear it crossbody I would just wear it top handle like this I just think this is such a cute bag it's definitely more of a statement piece like I have a look in mind that I want to wear this bag with so I'm super excited to style this and show you guys how I'm gonna wear it she is just the cutest thing ever I also love that this bag has feet on the bottom so you don't have to worry about like the bottom of your bag getting damaged if you place it down and it also has like these rubber things covering the feet I always wanted a black owned designer bag and now I have one and I'm so happy definitely love Brandon Blackwood bags I feel like they're super different but at the same time they're pieces that you can get a ton a ton of wear out of based off of what color and what style you choose so the next items that i want to get into with you babes are clothing items so we're going to basically go according to brand i have a lot of brands in here that i have shopped for the first time so i'm super excited to get into those with you so let's go ahead and jump into the first brand which is grind like a doll so i believe they are more of like an athleisure type of brand i feel like their clothing materials are very great for like in the gym running errands and things like that and girl they just came out with some swim and the swim is given what it's supposed to have gave so i might have to go ahead and double back on them so what i picked up this time and they actually sent me stuff before and i loved it i actually still wear the workout top in the gym the pants were a little bit too big for me so i did get rid of those but i find that my true size with them is a size medium so if you have the same body type as me then definitely recommend a size medium but i picked up this cute set from them it is in this beautiful beautiful like mauvey purple color y'all know your girl has really been trying to get into her color bag but I feel like this is like still neutral at the same time so it has like their logo right there which is GAD which stands for grind like a doll I like that the logo is like minimal it's not like in your face crazy and I also love that this is like a half a zip so super sporty definitely something you could wear in the gym or something you can wear if you're like going to the airport running errands or something like that I love that this top fits really really form-fitted so it's super tight on the body it just hugs the curves it makes you look amazing and y'all know I love me a good two-piece set so I had to pick up the matching leggings now I will say this this does not come in a set you do have to purchase the items separately but I actually prefer that because then I'm able to choose a larger bottom if I need it in a smaller top and vice versa. So I absolutely love that. Sometimes I don't like buying things in sets because I have to settle on one size. Luckily for me in this set, I can fit a medium in both. These are the leggings. So it has the logo again on the back. Again, the logo here is a bit bigger, but to me it's still very minimal. It's not too flashy. I love that these leggings also have pockets. So if you are wearing them to the gym, gym or something like that you can store like your card holder hand sanitizer whatever you need to your phone in that pocket and these are super cute you guys absolutely love these leggings they're super flattering I love the large waistband as well helps to suck you in helps you to look super good like this snatches you I love this set so much you guys I'm definitely gonna go back and get her in black because I just think this is so cute and super flattering and of course you don't have to wear them together as a set you can wear them separately so the next item that i want to get into is from a brand i had never heard of i literally came across this brand on tiktok tiktok literally puts me on to so many black owned brands that i've never ever heard of which i absolutely love so the name of this brand is jabemi i hope i'm saying that right but they are based in the uk which also made me pretty nervous because i was like girl if this does not fit right me trying to send this back is going to be a hassle but luckily i picked the perfect size and this item, Chef's Kiss, I absolutely love it. It's out of my comfort zone, so I'm excited to show y'all. How gorgeous is this skirt? Like, look at the vibrant cup, bruh. This skirt is so cute. Now, I picked this up in a UK 12, which I believe is a US 8. It fits me perfectly on the waist. I will tell you guys, this skirt does not have any stretch. On me, it is still like short enough to pass as a mini skirt, but it's not as short as I thought it would be. But I still really like it. I think it's super flattering. I'm also super short, you guys. So most things on me, if they look short on the model, they're not as short on me. But I love this skirt, you guys. I think it's so cute. I cannot wait to style. 
style it. The material is really nice. It's really thick. It is like kind of like a silky type of material. Not wait to wear this. Definitely out of my comfort zone, but I just could not resist. Like I just thought this was so gorgeous and the colors were so amazing. So cannot wait to style this for you guys over on a gram. So stay tuned for that. Love this. And I definitely will pick up some more items from them because they have a lot of cute stuff. So the next item that I want to get into with you guys is from Local European. You guys have seen these, I believe, in another haul that I've done. Can't remember which one, but I want to show you guys these again because I adore these and I need them to restock these in all the colors so I can pick them up. And they are these cargo pants. I love these, you guys. They are such nice quality. Now, I will say this. If you are a little bit shorter like me, these are a little bit long on me. They definitely drag on the brown, but I'm okay with that. When I wear cargos and I'm going for that baggy, effortless look, I'm okay with my pants dragging on the ground. One thing I really love about these cargo pants is you're able to cinch in the waist. So if you want them to fit more snug, they can, or you can leave this open and they'll fit a little bit more like low-waisted. I picked these up in a size medium large. These sell out every time they restock them so if you do see them available definitely get your hands on them ASAP I also love that they come with this jawstring at the bottom so you're able to like cinch it in at the bottom if you want so if you are a shorter girl like me and you don't want them dragging on the ground you can cinch it in and that will solve that problem but I absolutely love cargo pants I love wearing them with bodysuits little crop tops sneakers and you're good to go these retail for $110 which to me isn't too crazy for cargo pants most cargo pants typically go for that price i have seen people find cheaper alternatives on amazon but y'all i love supporting black owned so i'll pay the extra coin to support a black owned business so love these cargo pants the next item that i want to get into with you guys is a new brand that i've never shopped before which is the brand stripped kate definitely put me on to stripped i had never heard of stripped until i saw her wearing it and saw her in it and she was just like girl you need the body suits you need to try it. you need to try it and kate she never stirs your girl wrong okay so i was just like okay let me go ahead and see what it's giving especially because they were having a sale now their items are a little bit pricier but i'm the type of girl that if the quality is there i will spend the extra coin so i went ahead and picked this up and girl kate did not lie this material this quality bomb now the only thing i will say that i'm disappointed in is that i couldn't get it in black like i really wanted this in black they only had the white in stock and i was like oh, girl just get it just try it see what it's giving and it's giving okay so i'm definitely gonna go back and pick this up in black and one thing i love about it it is reversible so if you want you can have the zipper in the front and be really sexy with it or you can turn it around this way and be completely covered up so i love the versatility of it it's basically two bodysuits in one which is really nice the only thing i also would say is a downside to this is it is a little bit long on me when it comes to the biker shorts but I am only five feet, you guys, and I realize that most people make things according to a normal person's height, okay? So they are a little bit longer than I would typically like when it comes to length. It's still a really, really cute bodysuit. It snatches you super high quality, super stretchy. It's just, it's a really flattering bodysuit. I'm not gonna hold you. I'm not gonna lie to you. The only thing I'm nervous about when it comes to this bodysuit is it is completely white, and we all know whites can easily get a makeup stain on it or easily get something on it. Like, girl, I'm looking at right now and i already think i got something on it you guys can see it already has like a shape to it so whenever you see items that already have this like inward waist goes out in the hips you know that it's going to give body okay absolutely obsessed with this super nice thick material like uh, top tier okay shout out to stripped they is doing the dang thing and i definitely need to get me a black one okay baby a black one is a must for your girl so the next brand that i want to get into with you guys is bbx brand okay i don't know if i showed these to you guys or not but i still haven't worn it so i'm like girl you probably didn't show it to them but i don't know so if i've showed you this before i apologize but you won't see it again okay baby so i picked up this two-piece set so bbx brand i feel like is most known for their two-piece sets so i picked up these shorts right here Ugh so freaking cute y'all these shorts are so cute the waistband is super thick so that is really going to help to cinch in that waist it also has a jawstring so if you need to tighten it you can do so but y'all 
this looks so freaking good on it. I just feel so snatched in this. Now, I will say this. These run small, okay? I picked these up in a large. Thank God I did not go for a medium because there was no freaking way that I could fit a medium. But these are super cute. They do have pockets, which is a must for your girl. Like, I need pockets. They are just so flattering. And I truly feel like these are a pair of sweatshorts that you can throw on with heels and it won't look weird. I feel like some people try to pull off that sweatpants and heel look or that short sweatshirt and heel look. And it never looks right to me because I think nine times out of ten, they're not wearing a sweatshirt or a sweatpants that really fits the look um but these would fit the look amazingly so i absolutely love these and then i picked up the matching little cropped jacket how cute is this you guys now i did have to pick this up in a small it does fit me but i would probably get a medium if i decided to pick this up again the only reason i picked up a small is because the medium was sold out and i was given prestiana this is something i would definitely wear to like a lounge or a strip club girl let me not put my business out it's like that i don't be in the strip club like that y'all but if i get invited i'm gonna go and this is definitely something i would wear because i feel like certain places you go you don't want to be too dressed up absolutely love this definitely could mix and match these you do not have to wear these together but they do look really really cute together i'm probably gonna try her sweatpants when she restocks them in black that way i already have the crop jacket and i can mix and match the shorts but baby let me tell you something about miss bbx brand she is not cheap by any means necessary i think I think this set I'm pretty sure cost me like two something maybe even close to three hundred dollars let me just tell you this you need to remember that when you're checking out on her site you're checking out in pounds and when that converts to us dollars baby it's a very different number okay so just keep that in mind you do have to pay for shipping as well which i think was pretty pricey it was like 15 pounds or something like that so just keep that in mind i feel like brands that cost this much should really comp the shipping if you spend over a certain amount that's just me that's my thoughts i don't know if she does that now because i did buy this a while ago she's giving the girls quality though i will say that but i just wish that brands that do provide more expensive and luxury items would just comp the shipping you know what i mean that's i'm sorry that's just how i feel okay i said what i said and i mean what i say so the next items that i want to get into are also from a new brand that i have not shopped before but i'm so happy that i did and it is called babes and felines girl how could i not shop a clothing brand called babes like how how could i not okay and it's black on baby i'm here for it the first item that i want to share with you guys is a top i picked this up i believe in a size medium it is this cute white button down i know y'all probably girl how many white button downs do you need but this one is slightly different so it is a white button down and it goes longer in the front and then it's like short and cropped in the back super cute i was just like oh my god i've never seen a white button down like that and i feel like this is the type of white button down that it's sexy enough or cute enough to the point where you can wear it like out to brunch to get drunk drinks and things like that so I just love this I thought this was super cute and a spin on your basic like white button down I'm that girl that thinks you can never have too many white button downs because I just feel like there's so many different styles so many different ways you can wear them so I love 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 this super cute super flattering and then from them my favorite favorite thing that I picked up and I definitely want to go back and pick up more of these these are their no back gap jeans so basically these jeans are Levi's that they have reworked so that you don't have that weird gap in the back of your jeans I hope they do this for jean shorts because if they do I'm definitely definitely gonna pick me up a pair so they are your traditional Levi jeans these are the 505 they have different styles of Levi's that you can get but these are the 505 style and as you guys can see there's basically like this stitching in the back that makes it fit your waist perfectly. If you are a curvy girl, then you know a lot of us have smaller waist and bigger butts. And this is literally the perfect way that jeans should be made because I'm able to wear these non-stretch denim Levi jeans and also not have that weird gap in the back. I picked these up in a size 36. So on her website, she instructs you on how you should do your sizing based on your measurements. I would follow that to a T. Now I will say this, I could have 
went down a size in these if I wanted these to fit a bit more snug. I think I was a little concerned because I know how non-stretch Levi's can be and girl I was like I'd rather have a little bit more room than can't fit them okay so they do have a little bit of space and I definitely think I could go down a size next time but I absolutely love these you guys they're so cute it's so flattering you can wear these with a pair of heels you can wear these with a pair of sneakers they are just so gorgeous and they're just your traditional Levi jeans they look vintage I love how she still keeps the Levi tag on there as you guys can see on the inside even the Levi tag is still there this is genius like literally she is a genius like girl I need me some shorts okay please make some shorts for the girls who have to get everything altered like we don't want to do that like we don't okay babe so those are all of the items that I've picked up if you guys enjoyed this video and want to see more of these please be sure to give this video a thumbs up even though I'm still gonna film these because because baby, that's just what I'm gonna do, okay? Because at the end of the day, it's my channel, okay? But leave me a comment down below and let me know which item was your favorite or comment down some black owned brands that y'all feel like we need to know about. But I love you babe so much and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.